end result. Look at her. Look at her mama, man. Look at her. Hello, brothers and sisters. It's Kina. And don't mind my background. This is literally my kitchen because I'm about to do the mayo egg oil treatment to my hair. And I, I, I think everybody do this differently. Y'all gonna see how I do my male egg uh, oil treatment. I feel like it was perfect to do it right now because my friend is coming over and we're gonna be hanging out at my place. So while I'm letting the mayo and egg sit in my hair, I'm gonna clean up and straighten up a little bit and then rinse it out and then blow dry my hair. But we just gonna jump right in and get straight to this video. y'all i just showed you guys the ingredients that i'm using so we're gonna start off with duke's mayo i usually use hellman's but if y'all watch my last video y'all know i got duke's mayo this month because because i had i had to use it to make raisin cake sorry my hand is off sorry i couldn't get a better angle y'all i i tried so i'm sorry i just used this much mayo not that much not too much and one of my eggs already kind of accidentally cracked as you can see so we're just gonna open that Another egg. You really use one egg, but well, I want to use two. I want more effectiveness. Let me put some more mayo in there. Oh, sorry, y'all. Some more mayo up in there. And I don't know about everybody else, but I put olive oil uh, leave in conditioner in mine. Sorry, the top got broke out. I had this thing for years. So, sorry. Um, Oh, ooh, ooh, too much. Let's put um, olive oil leave-in conditioner in there. Of course, this is olive oil. So I'm gonna pour that up in there. And that's good. I'm gonna lift this up, show y'all what this looks like now. Show y'all what this looks like now. I think I'm gonna pick the camera up and show y'all. Yeah, I'm gonna pick the camera up and show y'all this time. See, so y'all can really see. So this is what it looks like now. Dang, I don't know if I can stir with one hand. Well, not stir one. I don't know if I can do this while I probably should have got a bigger bowl. Just because I put two eggs up in there, but it's okay. I'm gonna put y'all in a time lapse so y'all don't gotta deal with this. Unless y'all wanna hear the sound. No, I think that's just gonna annoy y'all. Let me just stir this up. Okay, y'all, it's mixed in pretty good, but I'm gonna finish stirring it up off camera. I'm so, 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 so sorry, but my hand is hurting I'm trying to hold this and stir at the same time. So I'm gonna uh, finish this up and then show y'all what it's supposed to look like when I'm done, okay? Guys, I am back and this is how it should look. Sorry for the little, it's a little bit of chunks in there, but it ain't gonna hurt nobody. Okay, so now that that's done, let me show y'all this disaster. Well, it really ain't that bad. <laughs> yep, this is what we're looking like, y'all. Let's get started. Let's just get started. I usually, I recommend doing this with gloves, but I'm out of gloves. And besides, this is my hair. My hands ain't nasty. So we just gonna dive right in. This together. And oh yeah, I forgot to tell y'all. Always, when y'all doing something with y'all hair, like make sure to always wear something that, not that you don't care about, but something that, you know, that you don't really care about. And I know I just said that, but that's something that I tend to do because doing this, I like to massage my hair. Now you can sex your hair off, which is something I normally do, but like I said, I have company coming over, so I kind of got to go a little fast, if you know what I'm saying. I'm just gonna massage this up into my hair. I know y'all probably think, what she doing? She ain't gonna get the roots. Yes, I'm gonna get the roots. But I like feeling that, ooh, I like feeling massaged. And ooh. And by the way, this ain't no tutorial or nothing. I'm just showing y'all how I do my mayo hair mask. And also, I was gonna do a, um, I was gonna do a Sheen try-on haul. 
again because I know I still got to do a part two, but honestly, y'all, I need a break from the trying on hauls, and I'm pretty sure y'all don't want to see that. I mean, if y'all do, I mean, that's cool, but that's probably going to have to wait till next week. <laughs> Usually, I already have a video on cue, but last week, I was supposed to go to my sister-in-law Montanae's birthday party, but I ended up not going because I didn't feel too good, and that was going to be posted for um, today's video but I ended up not going. I didn't have any content to put out and this just happened last minute. Well, I was supposed to do a Shein Tron haul, but honestly, I'm just be honest with y'all, I just really, really wasn't in the mood to content create. And plus, like I said, I was sick, so that probably had a little bit of an effect on that as well. So I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. But y'all understand, right? Y'all love me though, child, right? <laughs> I know y'all love me. I love y'all too. Yeah, yeah, y'all. I'm going ahead and doing this because I'm cooking for us. Like I said, she's coming over here, so I'm cooking that. Um, if y'all watch my shorts, I cook the most viral. Um, well, maybe not the most viral, but it's an easy meal that only takes like five ingredients on TikTok, and I made it. And um, that's what I'm making for us today. She said she want to try it, so. I'm doing that and I would vlog that cause like a girl's night over at my house, but um, she doesn't want to be on camera. So I'm going to respect um, her wishes with that. Also, that's another thing for anyone who content creates, how do, I want to know like, how do y'all go about it when y'all do certain things? Because me, I always ask someone, is it okay if I record, if I video before I just shove a camera in their face? And honestly, I don't, I be scared to like go to Walmart and record sometimes. That's why like when I did the grocery haul video, it was barely any recording. Plus the fact that like I said, I record on my own. Um, I record on my phone and I always have my groceries in my Walmart cart on uh, my Walmart app. So um, I didn't get to film that much. And last time I went, I didn't even think to pick up the camera. I just said, I'm just gonna do a straight up grocery haul. And that's probably what I'm gonna do from now on. But like. When you go on public places, like, do you ever feel like weird recording? I know I do. Like, I'm very, like, I know on here I'm all outgoing and even a little loud. Well, in my earlier videos, I was loud, but now I feel like I'm a little bit more calm, more chill. But on the outside, like, when I go places, I'm quiet. People, it's people that don't even know I talk. That's why I don't really promote my YouTube channel, because I don't want people who know me to see this version of myself. I just want the people that's on the internet to see me and find me. And if someone finds me that knows me, okay, cool. But I didn't lead you to find me. You found me on your own. But yeah, I just want to know that. Like, I want, And also, I want more content creator friends. Like, someone who I can talk to. Like, to just, I don't know. And also, I'm going to do a video. I was going to do this video, actually, before my friend came. But I was like, nah, I need to uh, do my hair. And I can just do that. But... I'm gonna do a whole video like dedicated to how it's been for me being on YouTube after one year. And I'm very excited. Like I wanna talk to y'all about like the pros and the cons of like being a content creator and like the struggles that I personally face. That's what's so good about being on YouTube. Like everybody's journey is different. There's people with a million subs, a hundred subs, 500 subs, a thousand subs, and everybody's going at like their own like personal paces. And I just think that's just so fine. Like that is just so fire to me. Now I'm just straight up massaging my hair. Woo! You wouldn't even know that my size like well, my hair grows back fast. Like with or without this mayo treatment, my hair grows back fast. I already feel the curls in my hair. Hey, hey, the mayo treatment. As soon as my hair gets wet, it just curls up. Like honestly, I don't know that much about hair. If y'all can't tell, I don't know that much about like hair and stuff. I say that I mean like the whole four C's and all of that. I don't know what type of hair texture I got. Y'all tell me if y'all know, but I, I I honestly don't know. I'm just keeping it real with you. I don't know. I just say my hair is curly. That's all I say. <laughs> Let me wash this off my hands. I'm gonna put a plastic bag on my head and then we're gonna wait 30 minutes and rinse this baby out and blow dry it and see how she looks. Wow. <laughs> you can use a shower cap. I usually use shower caps, but if I don't have any, a Walmart or Piggly Wiggly bag. And I just ripped the bag, hold on. It don't gotta be a Walmart or Piggly Wiggly. It can be any like grocery bag, as long as it's plastic. Tie 
let this baby sit for 30 minutes. I'm gonna straighten up and clean up during these 30 minutes and I will see y'all later. 20 minutes later. Hey you guys, so it's been um 20 minutes, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. Woo! This is what it's looking like after being up in there for like 20 minutes. And we're gonna go wash this out. So let's go. Now I'm sure y'all already know this, but always have cold water when you washing this out. Cause baby, if not, you gonna have some cooked eggs for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yeah, that's cold enough, so we're we'll going ahead and wash this out. Sorry if y'all can't, I'm gonna pull this up so y'all can see me a little bit more. Y'all can't, I'm so sorry. Yeah, you can see me. Ooh, but not that much. I'm sorry y'all ain't gonna be able to see me, but I'm gonna try to show y'all like, every time I like rinse this out, okay? Y'all gonna think I'm slow, but I didn't even explain the whole leave-in conditioner that I just washed out and then leave in. I'm gonna put more of that in my hair after it's dried up. That's the only time I wash my leave-in conditioner out. And plus, I don't always, always use it, but for this video, I want to use it because it's an olive oil product, and that's the only olive oil conditioner that I have, so that's why I mix it with the olive oil. So yeah, y'all understand, right? Right. Now, I'm about to put some y'all see it some two-in-one shampoo and conditioner in my hair like i said i got company coming over usually i use shampoo and conditioner but like i said i got company coming over and she'll probably be here sooner than i think so i'm just gonna go ahead and apply this to my hair and rinse this out as well oh talk about drainage is that's what it's called when your hair is longer than what it seems like when it's dry drainage what i know it ain't breakage breakage is when you got split ends and stuff satisfying. What I look like? Down in the comments who I look like. <laughs> I don't know who I look like. That's why I said I want y'all to tell me who I look like because I feel like I look like somebody. I'm gonna do some designs. I have like this. <laughs> Up, side, and do the perm wrap. <laughs> Okay, let me stop playing for I end up with some soap and buy, for real. I'm gonna go rinse this out. I'm probably not gonna show that because my hands are very soapy. So I'm probably just gonna wash this out and come back with me blow drying this out. Or when it's, I don't know. Just know I'm not gonna record me washing the shampoo out of my hair. So I'll be back. Okay, so I just finished washing this out. Oh, you see how long my hair, how much long my hair looks like? It probably won't look like this after I blow dry, but come on, we're gonna go to the bathroom and wrap this whole thing up. But uh, first, let me put a little bit of leave-in conditioner in my hair and some mousse. That's literally all I'm gonna put in my hair before I blow dry. Don't need that much. I'm heavy-handed, y'all. Bear with me, but I don't know how, but I can. My products, they just still here. He got a little mini fro going on. Even though my sides look, you know, you see my sides are short. I still got a little mini fro going on. See what that male did? Well, God did it, but the male assisted. I need to stop saying male. Mayo egg, leave-in conditioner, and olive oil. I'm just over here giving the mayo all the credit. And I normally use Hellman's mayo, not Duke's, but whew. Mousse, I use this mousse. Um, you about can use any type of mousse. That's a mousse that I just happened to grab whenever I went to the hair store and got mousse is all applied throughout my hair. Y'all notice I ain't use a comb, I'm not finna comb out these curls. Sometimes a comb can be your worst enemy. So baby, give me using my hands. Let's go below dry this out. Okay, so we are in my bathroom. Let me turn this on. Ah. Okay, so y'all, I don't know why, but my um blow dryer will not work in the bathroom, so we're gonna have to we're gonna go to the dining room and blow dry this out. Cause baby, I got scared for real. So let's go ahead and blow this blow dry this baby out. Y'all, I wanted to do this in the bathroom, but for some reason my bathroom electricity is tripping. So 
You're gonna do this in the living room. You just have to be okay with this type of background, okay? I'm sorry, y'all. I tried. I love y'all, but let's let's get started. Y'all, my hair dries quick. Now, some areas of my hair are a little damp just because, like, I don't want to put too, too, too much heat on my hair because it will mess up the curl pattern. It will. So, I don't blow dry my hair that much, but let me show y'all what this looks like. Let me go back to the table. This is how my hair is looking. <laughs> oh, I look good. Girl, we might, oh, let me fix that. Girl, we might need to go out. Let me show y'all, I'm sorry, but this background is not giving it to me, so we're gonna go to the bathroom, okay? Oh, okay, y'all. I don't sit in the bathroom, but ah, I'm tired, all right? I've been up on my feet all day long, and I went to the bathroom, tried to sit on the toilet, didn't look right, realized I would have to go in the kitchen, put a chair in the bathroom, then take the chair out as soon as I got done recording, so I just sat on my couch. But anyway, this is the end result of the hairstyle y'all it is so pretty i just throw some lipstick put some earrings in you know got a little bit dolled up because you know even though we still in my house you know i still want to look nice around my guests so yeah but um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i love love love, love y'all so 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 much and thank y'all for tuning into my channel and i will see y'all next saturday love y'all bye